Hello friends, welcome to CSS video tutorials series. From the past few video tutorials, we are trying to understand CSS text decoration property. In the previous video tutorials, we have understood how we can display a line under the text, how we can display a line over the text, how we can display a line above the text. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss how we can use the none value with respect to the text decoration. You can see here, I have already opened the default.html page in the notepad. It has the basic HTML document structure code written. Title is set to CSS properties demo. And also in the head section, I have written opening style tag, closing style tag. I have already opened default.html in the Chrome. Title is set to CSS properties demo. Let me go to the notepad. Here, I am going to say home. Then I say break. I say about us. Then I say break, file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that home and about us text got displayed. I want to convert them to hyperlink. If I need to convert them to hyperlink or hypertext, of course, I need to take help of the HTML anchor tag. You can see when I move the mouse over, cursor is changing to the text cursor, right? What I do here, I am going to use the anchor tag, opening a tag. And then I say here closing a tag. Here also same thing opening a tag and closing a tag. Then I use the hyperlink reference attribute href equal to at present I use hash. Here also same thing href equal to the value is going to be hash. Hash indicates be in the same page. File save go to browser and refresh. Now you can see that the home text and about us text converted to hyperlinks. Hyperlinks are going to have by default the blue color and they are going to have text decoration underline. You can see that both of them have underline. And when I move the mouse cursor, it is going to change to the hand cursor. You can see that right now. Normally, while creating websites, we like to remove the underlines of anchor elements. How do we do that? Of course, I need to take help of CSS text decoration property. I go to the style tag here. I say locate any anchor element in this page and say text dash decoration to none. You can see I am using the value none. What this does actually means it removes any text decoration present on the anchor element now. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that the underline is removed from both of the hyperlinks. I go back to the notepad and I say here locate any anchor element. If I hover the mouse over them, then what you do is you add text decoration under line semicolon. When I move the mouse cursor over any of the hyperlinks, we are going to find underline displayed. File, save, go to browser and refresh. Now, when I move the mouse cursor over the home, you can see that underline is displayed. When I go away, underline is removed. When I go on about us, you can see the underline is displayed. When I go away, you can see that there is no underline. Mouse over, mouse out, mouse over, mouse out. That is how we use the text decoration none value. I hope you guys have clearly understood. We can perform a lot of styling. At present, we are discussing text decoration. I hope you guys have understood completely how text decoration is helpful while creating websites. It has most important values none, underline, line through, overline. For this tutorial, this much is enough friends. In the next tutorial, we get some more information on CSS properties. For more benefits and be up to date, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to like, comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.